Hello everyone welcome to my channel. Please subscribe and keep watching for more details. This has been a rough week for sleuthers. Late on Sunday, Hallmark Movies Mysteries revealed in a Facebook social media reply that Mystery 101 was canceled. Devoted fans were shocked when they learned that Amy and Travis have solved the last mystery and are off the case. Moreover, this meant that the unresolved cliffhanger was never going to end in a happily ever after. Next, on Monday, Christopher Polaha confirmed the cancellation and thanked fans. Late Monday, Jill Wagner also thanked fans. Now, Mystery 101 screenwriter John Christian Plummer has graciously given TV shows Ace another exclusive interview. The talented scribe talks about his favorite moment in the series, shares a special message with fans, and reveals whether there can be another way for fans to learn how this love story ends. Lastly, JCP also shares a bit about his next Hallmark mystery, Mystery Island. Sleuthers will enjoy John's compelling reasons to keep watching and keep sleuthing. Could sleuthers get the ending another way? Will you try to find a way to tell your ending to this series? The show is owned by Hallmark, so I'm not really in a position to shop any further iterations of it. John Christian Plummer's Favorite Mystery 101 Moment do you have a favorite Mystery 101 moments? I have hundreds of favorite Mystery 101 moments. But if I had to choose one, it would certainly be when Amy and Travis tell each other they love each other. Photo, Christopher Polaha, Jill Wagner Credit, Copyright 2019 Crown Media United States LLC slash Photographer, Kaylee Schwarman. Clarification on Mystery 101 Script Was there a script made for the eighth movie? To clarify some confusion, I hadn't written the script for episode 8, just shared a pitch with Hallmark. I shared the pitch with the Hallmark Mysteries and More podcast, so if people want to hear it, they can listen. What can John Christian Plummer reveal about Hallmark's Mystery Island? Regarding your new Mystery Island mystery, I believe you told the Hallmark Mysteries and More podcast that this needs to be filmed pretty soon before hurricane season. I do realize you cannot spoil casting if there is a cast or location. Mystery Island hasn't been cast yet, and I don't know details yet about location, but I think it's all in motion. It will definitely be in a tropical location. John Christian Plummer talks about his new Hallmark mystery, Mystery Island. You have this new Mystery Island mystery and something else brewing, possibly with Christopher Pulaha. Do you have some persuasive words to share with disappointed Mystery 101 fans who want to give up watching Hallmark Movies Mysteries? First, I'm so grateful for the support for Mystery 101 over seven films and several years. I'm so grateful to HMM for making seven films. That's a huge commitment and undertaking. I understand the lost people feel right now. But a frequent theme in Mystery 101 was the danger of being stuck in the past. We saw this acutely in words can kill and deadly history. It's natural and human to look back, but nostalgia comes from the Greek word algia meaning pain, grief, distress. I always encourage people to strive to live in the present and look toward the future. If you are a fan of Mystery 101, a big part of that is the storytelling. So keep watching the stories I get to tell, starting with Mystery Island. Should Mystery 101 fans look to Francesca Quinn, P.I. for Travis and Amy ending? Regarding Francesca Quinn, P.I., can or should fans look to that movie as a possible resolution for Amy and Travis? No. Francesca Quinn, P.I. is its own story, and I hope to be able to tell the next chapter of Frankie and Wynn. Final words from John Christian Plummer on End of Mystery 101 and Fans John Christian Plummer, the screenwriter for Mystery 101, shares some words with the devoted fans of the Hallmark series. I echo Chris' profound appreciation for the legion of devoted Mystery 101 fans who made the series such a rating success. As the great Agatha Christie wrote, sometimes what you think is an end is only a beginning. I'm grateful to be working on a new whodunit, Mystery Island, and hope the Mystery 101 fans will give it a look when it premieres. Sleuthers, do you have any messages for the Mystery 101 screenwriter John Christian Plummer?